Hey, this is Dave with the Shepherd School, and I got a little tip for you today. This is some of our Zacon chicken breasts we just bought yesterday. Taken to, uh, since we've been making a lot of salads, a lot of stuff with chicken nuggets, um, we've decided that uh, when we get our Zacon chicken, and it comes in those uh, three 10 pound or four 10 pound bags inside the big box, basically we have been sealing up, you know, two breasts because they're, they're butterflies so just one one butterfly in a bag each we get about 20 or so bags and then one of the 10 pound bags we cut up into nuggets right now we want to freeze them but if you just cut all the nuggets up you throw them in a bag throw them in the freezer you're going to get this big old lump of uh, chicken so what we've done is just as we cut it up we spread it out and then freeze it individually, right? So we end up with individually frozen chicken nuggets. So we can put them in a bigger bag and then scoop some out to cook as we want. But what we've been doing is just putting them in one pound containers and just measure them out on the kitchen scale. Now let me just tell you, if you're gonna do that, make sure that you spread them out because if you don't, you end up with a big old frozen you know, yeah, I got several nuggets there that are frozen together. So, um, what we're probably going to do next time is go ahead and pre-cook about five pounds of it, and then put in one big bag because the boy goes through a lot of chicken nuggets. And as we did that video with the ground chicken nuggets, I think whole actual breast meat chunk would probably be a lot better for him, especially now that he's got his teeth and he likes chewing. So uh, anyway, that's all there is to it, and I hope that was useful to you. I appreciate you watching.